Today we want to speak about the forgiven grace of God. It's something that is very important. We cannot talk about forgiveness without sin. Let's say this is this is the creation of God. And now she will bring the sin. And add into the creation. And the creation became corrupted, full of sin. Jesus Christ is the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. God is not counting men's sin against them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah! Now when Jesus rose from the dead, this is what it looks like. Now the blood of Jesus wants to clean the creation. Let's see. Hallelujah. 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 The creation has turned back to good. Jesus' blood has washed us, has forgiven us all our sins, not in remaining. 1 John 1 verse 9. If we confess our sins, God is faithful to forgive us. The whole world, their sins have been forgiven. They must confess humble themselves and God will forgive them. If you have not given your life to Jesus, all you need to do is to say, Heavenly Father, I am a sinner. Please forgive me all my sins. Today I come to you. I ask you to wash me with the blood of your Son, Jesus Christ and receive me into your kingdom. Once you say that, you are saved. That is the love of God. And if you are a Christian who has seen all you need to do is to say, God, I have sinned against you. Please forgive me and wash me from all my sins. Once you say that, God forgive you. Everything. Isn't that amazing? Wow. That is good news. May God bless you. May God be with you. In the name of Jesus. If you are sick, be healed. In your body, in your blood, in your bones, in the name of Jesus. Be healed in your spirit, in your soul, in your mind, and in your body. The peace of God be with you and rest upon you. God has forgiven all your sins. He is not counting your sins against you. He loved you. And he cared for you. God bless you. And be with you. And see you sometime again. Bye.